Hey, good morning, party people. Another episode of the Getting Better videos. This sucks. This sucks. I don't know if you've ever been injured before or had, had uh, bruised ribs, but uh, this sucks. I, this is my second day. Um, it was Thursday, yeah, Friday, and Saturday, my second day. <sighs> trying to recover, and I can't. I can't even breathe because I can't breathe. <laughs> now the police, police thing is the thing. The cable wire did to me when I when it hit, it hit me in my my ribs and it bruised my ribs. I can't breathe. I can't take a deep breath. I can't raise my arm above my head. Um, I said it's getting better, but it's just it's not fun because I, I used I'm used to enjoying my classes by teaching my classes by doing my classes. Now I just feel like I'm a coach. And I want to play too, you know. I want to get in there, but I can't do it because when I take deep breaths, um, it puts pressure on my ribs and it hurts. And I can't, I can't, I can't do that. I can't, I can't stretch. I can't get, you know, uh, to where I'm, I'm breathing heavy. I, oh, it sucks. I can't even work out. I can't, I can't do anything to where after I start to breathing heavy. Not like I'm breathing like I'm tired, but. When you work out, you're, you're, I'm learning your lungs expand, even without actually getting tired, just getting to the work, getting to the rhythm. And I can't do that. I had to, I had to coach my class today, show them what to do, and point it out. And everybody's huffing and puffing. And the way, way I work is I can gauge my workouts through how I feel. And when I'm getting tired, you know, or, or I feel myself, you know, fatiguing, I'll ratchet back a little bit or change up the workout. You know, to, to to keep my my uh my clients and people I'm working with from getting too fatigued. But when I can't when I can't get in there and do it, it changes it up. I feel I feel like I'm cheating them out of a workout, or I feel like I'm pushing them too hard, and they're not you know they're they're not getting the benefit. They're just getting tired. Anybody can you know get in there and have folks do you know some people some some trainers they'll. They have folks do lunges all up and down the court, all around. This lunges, 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 and that's getting tired. You can get anybody tired. Anybody can do that. But to really dial in with your clients and help them reach their goal, help them to get you know get fatigued and you know target certain areas, you know try to get the heart rate up, bring it back down throughout the workout without doing it with them. It's, it's for me. It's challenging, and I don't like it. I don't like it at all. But we had a great class. Uh, everybody was telling about my story about the about the bike. Um, and one of the things that's really, I think, is really um, important is is being healthy and being in shape. Um, I made a joke about it, but I talk about it. I was when I went to see the uh, the doctor for um, he's checking my ribs. He's pushing on my abs to see where my um, if I you know if I had fractured or broken a rib. And he said, "Relax." And I'm looking at him like uh, I am relaxed, man. I'm an athlete, you know. I, I, I'm relaxed. I couldn't relax my. I mean, I, I could relax my abs. Even my, even in a relaxed position, my abs are still tight. So he's like thinking they're bones, but that's, you know, thinking I'm trying to flex my abs. I'm like, no, this this is how I am, just on a regular. So with that being said, with that handlebar pushing me in my ribs, if I didn't have tight abs, this thing probably would have went through me. I could have, you know. I had uh, internal damage as far as my 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 my, my uh, organs go, my heart, my lung. He said, he said I could I could have ruptured my lung. That's what he told me. I mean, it could have been really bad, but I'm in shape, so it wasn't. And I'm I see I'm thankful um, for me being in shape and doing what I do. But now I can't do it. You know, at least for the next two weeks. It takes two three weeks for your ribs to heal. So we'll see how it goes. All right, I'm headed back to the house, um, and it's like I said, it's kind of hard. I can't even look around. It's kind of hard to drive. Um, these ribs where they are, children are talking to me. I'm trying to look back in the back seat and realize my abs ain't what they used to be. So, anyway, y'all hold it down, man. Keep around and have a great rest of your day. Uh, be great. I'm out. Peace.